and they're off. Inside, Invective was away cleanly, splitting horses and on to challenge his Chapaloo, and Chapaloo is going to land the advantage for Zayas in the run to the first turn. From the outside, Indy Lion won't let him get far, and Uno Tiger is away third. After rail, Invective is now fourth from Magical Marriage and Grape Nuts Warrior. Second last is Steak and Cheese. The early trailer is Windoro. The early leader is Chapaloo at eight to one on top of length and a half, Indy Lion second. Uno Tiger is at the rail in third from a hard-held Magical Marriage who's now fourth. Fifth at the rail is Invective ahead of Grape Nuts Warrior. That's the favorite. Pink Cap about five lengths behind. Steak and Cheese is at his inside, and the trailer is Windoro. 24 and 2 for the opening quarter, less than five furlongs to go. Up front, the leader is Chapaloo, three parts of a length. Indy Lion is there second, Uno Tiger remains third. Magical Marriage is next, then at the rail, Invective, followed by an unhurried Grape Nuts Warrior. Steak and Cheese lingers toward the back of the field, and still at the back is Windoro. 48 and 3 for the opening half mile as they round the floor turn. Chapaloo in a bid to make all has the lead by half a length. Indy Lion is second. Uno Tiger is third. Invective is fourth. Steak and Cheese begins to warm to the task. Grape Nuts Warrior needs to do a ton better than that as they race to the top of the stretch. Three quarters, 112 and 1. Chapaloo turns first with the lead. From the outside, it's Indy Lion off cover at Steak and Cheese down the center and Grape Nuts Warrior. Eighth of a mile to go. Chapaloo is in front. From the outside, Grape Nuts Warrior begins to finish up now from between an Uno Tiger. Here comes Grape Nuts Warrior surging. Grape Nuts Warrior. He needed to do a ton better off the corner, and he did just that as he wore down Indy Lion for the money in 135 and 3.